of these. You guys got matching wow. Christmas sweater. And that is everything I got at Old Navy. So I got a new lens. What do you guys think? Do you like how it's seeing everything in the background? The one I was using was like kind of close up. So let me know if you guys like this. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a rundown of how our Thanksgiving went. My sister came over, she road tripped all the way over here and she stayed for about three days. Unfortunately, I was hoping she would stay for longer. But I was just really happy just to see her and spend the time that I did spend with her. And it was like so much fun. The day the day that she got here, like day before, after she got here, we went ice skating. We stayed local. We just went to downtown. They have like this awesome like skating ring. I got some clips. So let's go ahead and roll that right now. Where are we going? Ice skating. Ice skating? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Go with Emma. So we tried to attempt this, but we actually had to go to Target to pick up some coats because we had none of it. What about you, Emma? Your thoughts? Uh, I, yeah, I tried this, but I scared at the same time. Uh, he's a little nervous that you're going to fall your butt, huh? Yeah. It's okay. If we fall, what do we do, guys? Get back up. You excited, Lean? I'm so excited. Hi, me too. I got the skates on. I'm nervous. What about you? Can you walk it up? Oh, you got it. There you go. Emma's over there practicing. Ezra, we're going to wait until me and Lean like, get the hang of it, and then we'll see if we can do it. <laughs> gonna be doing some black friday shopping so i have my little niece with me esley say hi hi cute girl <laughs> and then em's here ezra ethan's with my sister he wants to be the main focus of the video guys if you were wondering why he was screaming so you ready for this yeah yeah you ready esley yeah Okay, the girls actually specifically asked for eyeliner. Emma wants pink and black liner, and Esley wants black and yellow liner. And here's Lean. She's coming. You ready? He's all grumpy. He told me he was gonna be good too, so let's see how it how it goes. Yeah, so we weren't sure if we were gonna see each other near Christmas, so we decided to just shop for each other's kids and give them their gifts. Now, it was really fun, and it was just, I don't know, the girls are too much. All right, I got the two girls with me and Ezra. <laughs> Ethan went with my sister, and where should we go to first, the toy aisle? No, uh, the eyeliner aisle. The eyeliner aisle. Okay, we're getting the makeup. Got a ton of little girl makeup, but they specifically wanted some liner. Oh look, Ezra found some for him. You want boy chopstick? This is kind of cute. I'm gonna get this because Ethan actually likes chopstick. I'll put those in their stockings. What do you want? This. This. That's cute. They're such girly girls, these two. I love this one. Are you this? Yeah. You like that one? Yeah. So in the beginning of the trip, Ezra is acting cranky, so I ended up getting him this Jurassic World yo-yo, and he was so happy about it. I didn't even know because he kind of just threw it in the cart and acted like he didn't care. But I put it back, and I was like, oh, he's going to be totally fine because my sister got him a Christmas gift. He's going to like that way more than this yo-yo. But you guys will see a little bit later on 
the mistake I made. It's just like so cool like how how much how much children we have you know it's like they're always gonna make like really cool memories. I've, I just, I don't know. I grew up with like five. I'm like the last out of five. So I appreciate like big families. Like I love it so much. And I didn't, really didn't even intentionally want a big family. It kind of just happened to you. Like I only thought I was only gonna have two kids for a while, but we just kind of kept having them. You guys also, Lululemon is having a sale. I kind of want to check it out. No. <laughs> I was like, oh what? Because you got shopping done, Emma, for yourself. Yeah, so I think we're going to go back to the house, have the kids open up all of their gifts. We're just going to do like a cute little gift exchange. And then after that, I still want to go shopping. We're going to probably ditch you kids with Uncle Eric. And, oh, she's calling right now. Hi, boo. Um, should I pick up Chick-fil-A for everybody or should we all go out to lunch or oh, what should we do? Chick-fil-A. No, we actually have, we have nuggets in the house, Lane. I could just put them in the oven and they'll be really good. Okay, that's good then. And all then right, for cool. us adults, I have like stuff to make sandwiches and stuff. And then maybe oh, we can okay, go out for perfect. dinner, cause so we could so that way we can go out for oh. dinner or something later. Oh, okay, that's good. Okay. Love when like people come over because like like we live in Colorado Springs. A lot of people like like moving here because they like all like the things to do, like nature stuff. So it's just like really cool when anybody comes to visit because like it gives us a reason to go out and like tour the stuff that we normally don't do. So we have all of the presents under the tree. We didn't want to do no wrapping because it's just gonna take too long and the kids are kind of impatient. So we're just gonna have them open up, open it up like that. Oh, I love it, I love it, I love it. That's your, oh, that was Ella's. My yo-yo bars. Whoa, Izzy. Oh, my yo-yo bars. Do you say thank you, Celine? Thank you, Celine. Oh, come on, She's like really been into eyeshadow too. Are we gonna beat my face too? Yeah. But now today is Sunday and I actually didn't like do too much shopping. I just went to Target specifically for my nieces and nephews like for toys for Christmas. But today I actually want to go and get like both Ethan and Emma, like all, basically all the kids. They knew like they, they knew they need like warmer things like long sleeves, leggings, sweaters, all that stuff. Ethan needs new shoes. So we're going to be going shopping today. I'm only taking Emma with me because... Last time I took Ezra and Ethan and well Ethan was like a piece of cake because my sister was there but he just doesn't want to go. I asked him already. He says no. He's going to stay with his dad. <laughs> but then Ezra, he said he was going to be like so perfect and he acted like this. <laughs> Yeah, so today we're keeping it simple. We're just having a girls' day. Me and Emma, she she like loves shopping, so like that's why I love like having her shop with me because she's like so much fun to shop with. Oh, I'll come in your vlog. Of course, you guys hear him. I'm with my little shopping buddy. Jesus bless me with <laughs> the girl that loves shopping. It doesn't complain on me like the boys. The first stop is. It's kind of late too for for me to be having coffee, but oh well, it's gonna be so good. Emma randomly, she's never ordered a mango dragon fruit refresher in her life, but she. Oh yeah, I did. You drink mommy's, but I don't think you've ever had your own. And then I fix a, a mango dragon fruit with no berries. Oh, look at her uh, order! Now you guys know what Emma's order is. <laughs> All right, here's this for you. Thank you. No problem. You have a good one. You too. Thanks. Why is it black? So I like my coffee, girl. <laughs> Um, I also wanted to talk about my sister bringing my mom's ashes and kind of just tell you guys a quick story about like um, just like our experience of what we ended up doing. Um, so my mom wanted an open casket cremation. We were always like thankfully all of us are very open <laughs> about like what we want just in case anything happens because that's kind of like the worst you know if you don't know like what people want. So we've always been very open. My mom in particular too. But I just obviously we we never thought we would ever be going through this not till like 20 20 30 years from now truly like we ended up spreading some of her ashes here in the Colorado Springs mountains it was really beautiful it was like pitched black at night and it was just, it was beautiful we cried a lot and we just listened to all of my mom's favorite music and we just kind of like 
bonded and like told stories about her because that's just always the best but yeah we ended up spreading them some over here my sister ended up spreading some in utah also some in vegas and like the rest of them which is a lot in the california big bear mountains because my mom always said she wanted to be spread in mountains but she didn't really tell us like what mountains so we thought it would be beautiful like just kind of like the states that we did travel to and that she visited the most my sister also brought my mom's ring too um, my mom had two rings, my sister has the other one, and I have this one. It's so pretty. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I literally never wear jewelry, but this ring is going to be guarded with my life. It's a little bit big, that's why I have it on, like the chunkiest finger I have, which is my pointer. Um, I have to get it sized, but it's really, really beautiful. My sister has one, I have one, and yeah, I have like no rings, but this one's just always going to be so, so special to me. Gemma's looking like a little Elsa today. Her little boots. So cute. Okay, guys. So that wasn't part of the plan, but I was just like really just like missing my mom. And <laughs> me and Emma were just like playing her songs and just weeping, and I literally ruined my makeup. It feels good to let out like a good cry. Like, I feel like sometimes I feel like so numb to everything that like I try to like block it out, you know? But just sometimes it's really good to let it out. That's what we did. We both like just let it out. And that was so cute too. She just, I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah guys, but we are here. I'm gonna like, I thankfully I brought like my makeup bag. <sighs> but thankfully I brought a little bit of makeup. So I'm just gonna kind of dab my foundation. I think it was because like this is like the f I haven't really been wanting to wear her ring. It's a little bit big so I need to get it sized on me um, but I was just staring at it and just thinking like I shouldn't even be wearing this ring like that's my mom's ring and my mom should be wearing it. Yeah so today I'm just being extra careful with it and yeah I just kind of felt like wearing like, a little piece of her with me. Um, sorry you guys I have like this pimple that just like grew. I don't feel like popping it either because it's it's just gonna look red and I'm gonna walk around with like a bloody, bloody pimple on my face. A little bit of lip gloss. <laughs> Emma just loves watching me do my makeup. Emma has been like literally all into makeup too, you guys. She's asking for a pink liner, black liner. I'm like, what? Like, but okay, so this is my thing. Let me know what you guys think um, down below, but I'm like totally okay with her like playing around with makeup. I feel like when I was younger, um, I kind of just got thrown in with the wolves. I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't know anything about makeup. My mom didn't really wear makeup. My stepmom, she didn't really teach me to. And I feel like it's kind of important just to let them like just practice. And Emma's like, she's been <laughs> really practicing. She's been having like little eyeshadow just today. She didn't do it just because I was like, we're going places like, oh, and that's another thing. I just kind of have her wash it off before we leave anywhere unless it's like very subtle and I think it's totally fine. Um, but yeah, so I thought it was totally fine, like, for her to ask for a liner because I'm like, it took me forever to learn. So maybe it's, like, best if she kind of, like, practices and, like, you know, with eyeliner because it could be pretty tricky. So she's over here. It's, she took my brush right now. <laughs> and look what she's doing. <laughs> Hey, you know, she's pulling her weight around here, so it's nice. Come on, Ember. Whoa, look at you. Yay. Good, good. All right, guys, so we are back. I'm going to show you a Black Friday haul, even though it wasn't Black Friday, but they still had a ton of sales going on, especially Old Navy, H&M. Honestly, H&M was kind of like the regular prices, but I actually donated some clothes and I got 10% off my purchase and it actually went down like a lot, you guys. That 10% does help, especially if you are buying a lot of clothes at once. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and start off with Old Navy. I mostly got stuff for Emma and Ember here. Because Emma and Ember. Yeah, Emma and Ember. Their, their names are very similar. But yeah, I got her this like active 
pullover. It's like a little turtleneck. And then I got her quite a few leggings. And these were on sale too for $5 for all of their leggings. So that was really cool. So I got her these cream and black heart leggings. I also got her these, which I freaking love. Like these Wow. So cool, huh? Yeah. Especially for like the holidays. I like the black and white. So classy and so cute. Are they thick? Um, no, that's the only uh -huh. thing. They're not thick. But I did get her one pair of thick leggings, especially for the winter time. And then I got her this set, kind of. I thought this was really cute. This was on sale too, so it definitely wasn't too much. So I got her these little jogger pants. They're gray. They're gray, and they look like this. Very cute. She loves, loves being comfortable at school, you guys. That in mind, so I try to find a balance for both of her and I, like so. You know, like getting her dressed up and stuff, but she loves to be comfortable. So, yeah, I got her this set. It's gray. It's a hoodie pullover. Kind of thin, so it's like a pullover. And it also has like a twisty here in the front. I thought that was really cute. And then for Ember, she needed a sweater because she doesn't have much. So, actually, she had like one sweater, and that was Emma's old yeah. sweater when she was her age. So, we need to get her one of her own. So I got her the cream polar bear looking sweater. It's so soft and cozy. So pretty. And it has two little oh, ears. Yes. So you can be all bundled up, Ember. So this is an updated version of Ezra's sweater that he was using all last year. It's a cream Sherpa with brown little details. So it looks like this. This is the only thing that wasn't on sale. I was so close to not getting it because it wasn't on sale, but I was like, he needs more mm. sweaters. He has I recently bought him one, and then this is his second one for the years, and that actually fits him because last year he was wearing 2-3T, to three T, but now he's like 4T to 5T, which is insane. Speaking of those thick leggings, babe, that you were saying, I got her these like pinkish ones. She picked it, and I thought these were really cute. She's in the size 8, if you guys were wondering. They're very thick fleece, so they're definitely going to keep her warm on those like freezing days when it's snowing at school. And then this is for Ember. I thought this was really cute. I love little jumpers like this. It's denim. Even though it's like winter time coming up, I could put like a white long sleeve underneath. And then I got Emma these socks to go with her boots. And this dress was only $10 too. So I got her this black dress. Very cute, simple with like cute little tights, you guys, boots, jacket. You guys get the vibe. And then I also got Ember these, babe. These little Christmas leggings Aww. for the season. She, we compare her in like a cream top or a black top or any solid color top would look really cute. And then these are for Emma, another pair of leggings. These are only five bucks too, you guys. And these look like a regular pair of black leggings, but they have like these wow. crisscrosses on the side. So it gives her a little bit more fashion. And this is like when it's gonna be like a little bit warmer too with like regular tennis shoes so you can show that off and that is everything i got at old navy all right guys next up is h&m this place i actually went ham i got like a ton of stuff for ethan ton of stuff for ezra bunch of stuff for ember actually because he needed new clothes she's really just like she's having a lot of like colder items you guys we are going to be doing of course some holiday like photos, but we're also gonna be doing our intro maybe tomorrow or the next day because Vlogmas is coming up. And of course, we're lagging on it. So we have to do like a quick little intro. I think we're gonna go up to the mountains and just take some cute little videos and we'll figure out what we're gonna do. But this is an option Emma's gonna be wearing. It's this like, is it gold bib or brownish? It's like a rose gold, copper gold. A copper gold, there you go, yeah. It's like a copper gold dress, very cute. Um, so this was my second option actually. My first option is this skirt with like a white like little collared top. Um, but this isn't a size 3 to 4 you guys. What? They didn't have her size. But I like kind of put it on her and it looked fine. It might be like a little short yeah. but she's gonna wear tights and keep her warm and stuff. So this is like the second option. I'm hoping this one works out but if not we had that dress as a backup plan. Oh and then we also went to Claire's and we just got this little headband to match. It's like a cream, no, a white headband, and it has like a little knot here. So cute. And then this is for Ember. Just for like, your, you know, our like, just like festive photos and like our Vlogmas intro. I thought this was really cute. So you guys are going to get like a sneak peek of our outfits for that day. Actually, this one's cute for Ember. Wow. Huh, for like our Vlogmas intro with this. And those, yeah. 
Oh, what a vibe! Like so cute, Abby. What do you think? You like it? She oh, she says no. no! Oh my gosh, Amber! They actually came out with the cutest like plum color for the season. I freaking love snag these up, you guys. You're so cute. They're well. Oh, this one's actually pricey. What the heck? Seventeen ninety nine for this top, but it's so cute though. Very like classy. Emma has one, but in cream. Very very cute with like black tights or white tights. And then I also got her this dress. This is actually, this one was actually a good deal. This was $9.99. For a cute dress like this? Yes, please. Like a plum color. It's corduroy with white dots all over it. And then I also got her two onesies because Eric's squeezing her, this poor child, into a 12 month onesie. It's looking all like this on her. It's so embarrassing. It fits. It buttons. He's too much, but it's this plum color. And then the second one, I was like a little iffy about. They're cute, they're roses. I don't know. It's a little much, this one, but it came as a two pack, so. So this is the other option. This was like the first thing I think I was like, maybe, maybe, what do you think? The reindeer and this one for the holiday uh, photos. Maybe that one. I, I know, it's kind of more special, yeah. well, especially since Emma's gonna be dressed up. So I got her this white dress very roughly with gold polka dots all over you guys so cute so perfect for the holidays with her little headband i feel like this still goes too yes definitely look at her and then of course to keep her warm we just put like black tights underneath but you already know how much like photos i do like to take for instagram the look for christmas you guys wow isn't that cute? cute yeah. That's so adorable, like red, very festive. You like it? And this was $14.99. She likes this one. Oh, she, she likes like this it. one. So guess what I found for Ethan. Oh, Ethan, so look. He's had the sweater like three different times. It feels like. That's like the one that he passed down to Ezra. Yeah, Ezra has one that fits yeah. him right now. And yeah, I got this. This was on the clearance rack too. It was a it wasn't that much saving. Oh, actually, it was. Actually, it was ten dollars savings. Originally thirty bucks, and is on sale for twenty one dollars. Very thick. Even though this one's like seems pretty thin, you guys, it's actually really thick. And he needs more zippies too. And it has like this cool little leather detailing right here. And then Ethan and Ezra, are you guys ready to see this? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for these. You guys got matching wow. Christmas. Sweater. They're just smiling at me, you guys. They have no reaction. They're just happy. <laughs> it's ugly, but it's not ugly. You, know, you guys know what I mean. Like, just their cute little Christmas sweater. It has, like, little fluffies. And I like to get the kids, like, a mm, couple little festive tops for the season. I really don't like to spend too much on, like, their Christmassy festive tops. And, babe, they also got another matching outfit. Because, you know, H&M has, like... Yeah, different... All the sizes. So I had to get the boys. Wow. I know, so they're gonna be like cute little twitties matching. I would do this totally more often for Emma and Ember, but their age gap is so huge. So I like to do it for the boys to keep them nice and warm and toasty for school. And Ezra, the same thing. Isn't that so cute? And then for Ethan, I got him. Ooh. A little Hogwarts crew like neck. That. That's cool. Last time we went to H and M to get some like Hogwarts merch. Yeah, I was pointing them all out because they look really cool. Yeah, I, I saw. I, like that one. I seen this one too, and I thought this was perfect. Their sizes are so weird sometimes, but yeah, this one's for Ezra. It's a little bit bigger. I really like the colors. I feel like you can't go wrong with like thick pullovers like this because it just keeps them so like warm, and then with like a jacket on top. And they'll just be super layered and very, very warm. And then Emma seen these gloves, you guys. And whenever it is recess, you know, their hands get cold. And the kids, they literally throw our kids out there in the freezing temperatures. If it's like above freezing temperatures, we'll just go ahead and send them out. But that could be like 39 degrees if it's technically not freezing, you guys. They just toss them out. <laughs> yeah, so this is for Ethan. Such a like form-fitting thermal top. And it has like a zipper here on the chest. I don't know, I thought this was very plain but interesting. And then this is the last item. This is for Ezra and it's a two-piece set. I actually was gonna get this another matching set but they didn't have um, eight to eight to 10. They only had nine to 10. I, I like, think that's his size. Nine to 10? I'm pretty sure. 
Dude, I got him all 8 to 10. That's like two years ago. Yeah, but I seen this little to be set. I showed you guys earlier too. Very cute, very warm. I got him a to be set like this at Zara. It's like a light green color and I love putting him in it. And he looks so comfy and cute. Just so cozy, you know? And that is everything you guys I got for Black Friday. Oh, actually, let me go ahead and show you guys the stuff I actually picked up on Black Friday. So I did two transactions and I feel like I got a pretty good discount. Yeah, so I'm gonna show you everything in this bag. This is all of like the body care. I, I needed body care so bad, you guys. And I've been waiting for Black Friday. Actually, I think the third or the fourth is coming up and I need to go there again to stock up on some candles. So I got this winter candy apple scent. This one smells so good, you guys. So I got like the moisturizing. Oh, freaking crap. Yeah, but I ended up getting the Winsor Candy Apple Body Scrub. I love their body scrubs. They're amazing. And they smell so good. Oh, this one just smells so... This one just smells so fresh and so sweet at the same time. And then I also got the body spray as well. I don't want to put it on. I haven't used it yet. Oh, dang, I smell good. But I also seen the fairy tale line from Bath and Body Works too. And apparently this is the body wash. I meant to get the body creams, you guys. Yeah, this one's in the scent of fairy tale. This one just smells like like a go-to good scent. So that is why I picked this one up. Notes. Okay, it's pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. But yeah, I got the body cream for the fairy tale scents. And then of course the body mist too. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're brand new, click that subscribe button and ring the bell to get notified every single time I upload a new video. Also thumbs this video up and definitely stay tuned for Vlogmas, you guys.